welcome back to my channel i wanted to do this in two parts because I, I i didn't want the videos to be long i'm trying to keep my videos short um as short as they possibly can be with commentary but this part was definitely uh worth revisiting this is i love hymns and so this takes her out of the frustration that she just was in because the musician wasn't going with her and so out of her frustration still connected to the spirit she then goes into what she said her mother would sing and this moment because you can tell she was so frustrated by the previous moment that this moment just changes the atmosphere and i'll let it speak for itself so let's get to the footage She also sang this, I know you won't know it, so it's okay. She used to say, I am satisfied. the previous video the atmosphere it was so fiery after this and it's in that and that's what a good hymn and a person that that sings the hymn ministers the hymn let's clarify ministers rather than sings ministers the hymn she ministered that hymn and i don't know if it's because of the lack of accompaniment i'm not sure why but it just was powerful from the beginning to end so let's get to uh reviewing she also sang this, I know you won't know it, so it's okay. She used to say, I am satisfied. Oh, I am satisfied. Sim 
simple something simple is I'm satisfied but that mm, because I can't do it and I don't even know what it was but she just went down slid down the it's simple but it adds um, musicality to a song where you're singing with no music you know so just love this woman <laughs> and the the wisdom in the in the moment so let's continue she said i am satisfied with jesus but the question comes to me as i think of words are so simple yet powerful and I think that's what hymns do they're, they're, this, the simplicity of the words and the power in the words is my master satisfied with me satisfied with with me she looked her hands and said more of that I'm not doing it right but just ministering the words and giving it um, color and I say that's what the runs doing it's not defiling the song it's giving it color but the words are so powerful but it's not taking away from the words because she's not overdoing it's, it's just enough so let, let's keep going And the song is so powerful to where you don't need a whole lot of coloring because <laughs> she said i'm satisfied i'm but when i think of calvary <laughs> it, it brings it back to the question is my master It's like she's shifting gears. I'm like, this lady, the musicality in her voice. It's it, somebody says she has an organ in her throat. What was that? What you went down? You went back up? You, it just you can't deny this gift. Let's keep going. Master, yes, yes, yes. Satisfied My with with me. Where you feel God is satisfied. All He wants is a yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. 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 Creative. If it did, creative on whoever wrote the song. If you're not at that place, all it wants is a yes. And if you watch the first video, you listen to the atmosphere. The atmosphere, though you are impressed with her gift, you can tell it's a frustrating atmosphere and she's ministering out of frustration. So the atmosphere is kind of struggling. But this, it almost like it like when you're having a rainy day and then the clouds are, about, uh, are are there and then you see the little sunshine coming through this is like light to the to the to the atmosphere in the room and that's why everybody goes into like response I 
won't even dare try. She's up. It's like she's. Oh, uh, I I wouldn't dare. But it's 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 phenomenal. The gift mixed with the anointing, and the anointing is not in the runs. It's so not in the runs. It's so not in the runs. It is in the ministry of the song and the accompaniment of the runs is the icing on the cake, as I always say. She went down, yes, 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 yes. <sighs> Love it. On a Monday, yes. Woo! On a Tuesday, yes. On a Wednesday, yes. On Wednesday night, Thursday morning, yes. Now, <laughs> that mmm, even in the church house, that mmm takes you in. It's it's the moaning and the groaning. It's just the black heritage all together. That mmm, they say he knows, he hears your moans and, and deciphers your moans. That mmm just sets the place of fire. I say this! <laughs> You can't deny <laughs> the spirit change that's in the room because of this song. So it this is a um Betty Nelson always says to remember the hymns of the church. Other folks in the in that are historical say, remember the hymns of the church. The hymns will bring you over. They just have so much power, and it's the simplicity of the words. It's just, it's it's ministry. <laughs> and that's why I wanted to revisit this part specifically. But anyway, so that's the end of this little two-part series. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. And y'all let me know what you think. Did you like it? Did the 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 did it need music? Was it too many runs? Um, did you feel anything? I mean, some folk are like, they can, because they're so upset with her, they can never hear her anymore or can never receive from her anymore. I still receive. I mean, it's this is so pointed. But y'all, let me know what y'all think. Um, not sure what I'm finna do next, but we'll see. Y'all stay tuned. Like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for being on my channel, and hope you continue to uh, be a part of it. God bless you.